Now, let's let's talk just a little bit about Kamala Harris. The theme of her campaign is that she has never seen, has never been in the room with, and doesn't even know the name of the current president of the United States. Even though she's his vice president, and even though she cast the deciding vote on trillions of dollars of his spending, even though he bragged about her being in the room when all decisions were made, Kamala Harris is going around the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania and the whole country saying, I don't know who this guy is, and I had nothing to do with it. Well, Kamala, we have the record and we have the tape, and unfortunately, some of the tape we have is in your own words. And you know, when she did this View interview, they said, well, Kamala Harris, what is one thing, one thing that you would have done differently than Joe Biden over the last three and a half years? And you know what she said? Nothing comes to mind. That is, I think, the official tagline of the Kamala Harris campaign for president. Nothing comes to mind, right? That's, that, now, there's something else that happened this week, and of course our friends in the media like to pretend that it hasn't happened, but I don't know if you saw the news that uh, apparently Kamala Harris wrote this book called Smart on Crime about 15, 20 years ago. That's not the joke, actually. <laughs> but <laughs> Kamala Harris wrote this book, and it turns out she plagiarized whole sections of the book. I mean, 30 years ago, 30 years ago, that's the kind of scandal that would have ended a presidential campaign. And now our entire media just kind of collectively sighs and says, oh, it's no big deal that she passed off somebody else's work as her own. Well, we in this room, because we believe in integrity and we believe in honesty, we believe it is a big deal that the President of the United States lies instead of telling the truth, and we're not going to let her forget about it. And it's not just what she copied, but it's where she copied it from. You know, I, I wrote a book in 2016 called Hillbilly Elegy. I see some of you have read it. Thank you. And my friends, it's available wherever bookstores are sold, if you haven't got your copy. But, you know, I, I, I think one big difference between me and Kamala Harris is that I wrote my book and she copied hers from Wikipedia. And I don't think that we want to make the person who copies her book from Wikipedia the president of the United States. We'd like to make a guy who's already done the job as president and did a very damn good job. And that's Donald J. Trump. And that's our guy for president of the United States. Now, we ought to talk just a little bit, of course, about the economic problems that are caused by Kamala Harris's leadership, because when you've got a vice president who, instead of doing her job, copies from Wikipedia, it leads to some of the problems that we have in our country 